Hello, this is Elliot Schlissel. Uh, today I'm going to talk to you about an ACS case where ACS was unable to show a child endangered by the mother's mental illness. The Administration of the Children's Services, which is referred to as ACS, brought a petition in the family court. They claimed mom was mentally ill. ACS claimed because of her impaired ability she couldn't take care of her son. They alleged the son was neglected. Initially, ACS successfully removed the child from the mother's household, but the child was returned. Support services were put in place for mom. The mother was psychiatrically institutionalized again a year later. Now ACS said, I'm the, we're done. They brought a petition seeking to take custody of the child away from mom. The court initially granted this relief, and the child was put in a non-kinship foster home. A hearing was thereafter held. At the hearing, the, talk took into, the court took into consideration that mental illness does not necessarily require the finding of neglect. Children shouldn't be removed if a parent has some problems, unless it is found that parent's mental illness creates an eminent risk to the child's health and well-being. In this case, the court found ACS failed to establish this. Yes, the mom had problems, but she loved her child, and the child wasn't in an eminent risk or danger as a result of her mental illness. This is Elliot Schlissel, ACS defense lawyer, signing off.